So Keith, I know you mentioned this at the top of the show. Uh, we have this first kind of section of the precipitation that comes in around eight o'clock. Yep. And then it kind of goes overnight. Break, yeah. And then around one o'clock, it kind of comes at us again. So yeah. what does this mean for the morning commute tomorrow? I think it's I think it's not good over southern Maine. I, I've been uh, promising anybody who will ask me snow day tomorrow. So hopefully. That is correct. Okay. Uh, because the timing is just bad. I think a lot of the snow is going to be on the ground in the morning. It's still snowing. We get a little break mid-morning, but the decisions have already been made at that point. Well, right? like, speaking of which, yeah. we've already gotten a whole bunch of parking bans. Yeah. So yeah. the cities and towns sense. are expecting it. Yeah. There's enough snow that that's going to be an issue. So right now, it's starting to work its way in. Now, uh, some of this is rain. Some of this is sleet. Some of it is snow. Uh, but the radar, remember, we've talked about this at length, but we're going to do it again. This radar algorithm is not perfect. So it has an idea whether snow and sleet um, and rain, but it doesn't know exactly where that delineation is. So that whole thing is moving into an air mass that is, of course, unquestionably too warm right now, right? 37, 38, 38, that's not gonna get it done. But if you've been following along the last few days, we've already accounted for this aspect of it, that we're gonna lose a little moisture on the front end that's not really gonna be able to accumulate as snow efficiently. So this is six o'clock, here comes eight o'clock, starting to work into York County, into Cumberland County as well. And so along the coast, we're gonna fight here. Um, maybe it's rain and sleet, maybe it's snow and sleet, but it's nothing that piles up too quickly here prior to, I'd say, about 10 o'clock. And then after that, we all get colds enough. We're in the low 30s, the wind turns north, and now we're really, really cooking here because that, this is where we're gonna do most of our accumulation overnight uh, and into early tomorrow morning. And so here we are at 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, and then now 6 o'clock. You can see we've still got some good bands along the coastline, the mid-coast, into down east Maine especially. And then here's that break, late morning through about the middle of the day. And then a second wave comes in, tries to give us another hit of snow, say noon to 2 o'clock, and then that's it. We could pick up another inch, inch and a half with that. But I think kind of what you wake up to over southern Maine will be the vast majority of what we get total. Uh, so three to six inches is what I've got broadly all the way into down east Maine. Five to eight is the jackpot area here. And you'll notice that we stuck with this shading along the coastline that's lower than inland. And that's just because I think we will have trouble initially with the snow. And so you figure you burn an inch or two inches with kind of garbage front end snow that doesn't accumulate and, and that comes off the top. So you end up with that. And then one to three into the uh, Bangor area. So. We have a quiet weekend, and then you probably already know we've got a couple of more storms coming. I was very close to having a map for Monday's storm, and then the computer models shifted it way east, made it a coastal snowstorm instead of a mountain snowstorm, and I said, you know what, we can't do this. So this is a storm coming in Sunday night into Monday for sure. I just don't know where that mix line is. And then another one Wednesday night into Thursday. That looks like a pre pretty big magnitude storm. So either way, we've got these three storms in under seven days. And um, that's why you tolerate me the other parts of the year, just, to, just, for, these, just for these rare weeks. Um, so we will try to nail that down. My guess is at this point, we won't be able to do that until the snow lightens up tomorrow. Mm. But yeah, you know, this is not a blockbuster, but a solid six inches of snow is six inches of snow. Yeah. I know Mainers like to be Mainers about it. Eh, it's just a dusting, but it's, well, it's, it's good. It's snow. decent. So, uh, and then we'll careful. see what the other ones bring us. And I think where those trend is going to change our whole picture, right? If we connect on those two with snow, by the end of the week, we're going to be sitting on a ton of snow. Mm -hmm. If they mix, then it'll be the same old around here. You mm. know? All right. We'll see what happens. Thanks, Keith.